Hey guys, come on downstairs. We're playing UC Santa Barbara Gauchos baseball here on Mama's Basement. Today we have a three-game series with the Oklahoma Sooners from Santa Barbara, California, as we start to wind down towards the conference season starting. The Sooners come in at, to this one at 6-11, and 11, and we're going to go ahead and manage this first game. Oklahoma jumps out to a 2 to nothing lead. We're in the fourth inning. We put one on the board. We're in the fifth now. Two to one, Oklahoma. Sixth, tied at two. Obviously, we speeded this up. We managed it much slower. And uh, three to two lead. We go to the ninth. We're just going to try to hold on to this one, and we do. Garter gets the save, and UC Santa Barbara with a three to two win over the Oklahoma Sooners. Improves us to nine and eight, two games behind Cal State Fullerton. In the Big West Conference, UC Santa Barbara, Regan went two for three. Two runs, one double. Geyer was three for four. Colbert gets the win, his fourth of the season. Buchanan, two for three with a double and an RBI. Robertson went one for three with a double and an RBI for the Sooners. Ferreria was the losing pitcher. He went three and two-thirds, gave up three hits and one run in relief. He did strike out five batters, though. And UC Santa Barbara gets the three-to-one win to open up this three-game series. Second game will be Ammon. With a 2.95 ERA against Patrick Casanova with a 3.52 ERA. And we will manage this one as well. We're in the second inning, up one to nothing. We go to the top of the third, still leading. Top of the fourth. Oklahoma hit a home run. And they are now up three to one in the fifth, four to one in the sixth. Bottom of the sixth, still four to one. And we are running out of time. We put a couple on the board. We go to the ninth inning. Bottom of the ninth, and we score in the bottom of the ninth to force it to extra innings. We're in the tenth, and Oklahoma scores in the eleventh, and we are unable to answer. So Oklahoma gets the extra innings win in the second game, five to four. Kessel went three for four with a double and RBI. Falk went two for three with a home run and two RBIs for the Sooners. Crow gets the win. Garter gets the loss. He threw two innings, gave up two hits, one run, two strikeouts, and a walk. Carson was two for four with a run, and Regan two for four with two RBIs on the day. We fall back to nine and nine, and we are three games behind the Cal State Fullerton Titans in the Big West Conference standings. As we head to the final game of this three-game series with the Sooners, we face Al Tolar, a 6.23 ERA, and we are live here in Santa Barbara, California. The 7-12 and 12 Oklahoma Sooners take on the 9-9 and 9 UC Santa Barbara Gauchos. It is Big West Conference Baseball here on Mama's Basement. Sean Sosinski takes the hill. He's 1-3 on the year, making a 7th start. 5.40 ERA. And Bubba Lunsford will lead things off for the Oklahoma Sooners. And we are underway. Lunsford drives this one into right center field. It's going to split the gap. Zerby's on his horse. It's at the wall. Zerby will run it down. Lunsford is rounded second. He's heading to third, and he's going to be in with a stand-up triple to lead off the game on the game's first pitch. The batting order for the Sooners. Center fielder Lunsford, who just got the hit. Guzman, Kessel, Falk has five home runs and is batting 346. Pettyjohn, Robertson, Bolt, Buchanan, and the shortstop Mallet is the ninth hitter. So this is Guzman with... A runner on third and nobody out. Guzman swings and misses. Sosinski is the starter. We look at the defense for the Gauchos. Geyer, Zerby, and Sorgi in the outfield. Carson, Regan, Helton, and Dessa around the infield from third to first. Drever behind the plate. Sosinski takes the hill for us in the rubber match of this three-game series. Batter now is Kessel with one down and a runner on. Kessel's going to drive this one deep to left field. Geyer can't run it down. It's at the wall. It one hops the wall. Lunsford scores easily. And Oklahoma jumps out one to nothing. Here is Jim Falk, the right fielder. Five home runs on the year for Falk. Santa Barbara's going to have to be careful with him. Here's a drive to left. Geyer underneath it makes the play. Runner tagging from second, and he will move up to third. And Antoine Pettyjohn steps in. He's the designated hitter. And Pettyjohn takes the cutter off the plate for ball one, then grounds it to Carson at third. On to first for the final out of the inning. And we get a chance to look at Al Tolar. He's one and two 
A 6.23 ERA, 21 strikeouts and 10 walks so far on the season. The batting order for the Gauchos, Helton, Carson, Colchernari have uh, all been hitting much better lately if they've risen their average out of the 100s and they are finally above the Mendoza line. Regan is our home run leader with, uh, I believe that was three, and he's the cleanup batter. Here is Helton. Helton grounds it right back up the middle, quick as a cat, Tolar off the rubber. Is able to pick it up and throw him out. We got Bolt, Lunsford, and Falk in the outfield. Kessel, Mallet, Guzman, and Buchanan around the infield. Robertson is behind the plate. Tolar is on the mound for Oklahoma out of the Big 12. Here on the road in Santa Barbara, California. A little springtime college baseball. 1-1 one, one count with one out. Fouled off. And this is Carson. Carson, another one grounded right back up the middle. Easier play that time by Tolar. And he's on to first for out number two. Coltranari steps in. He hits this one high into center field. Catch is made by Bubba Lunsford. And that will end the first inning. We go to the top of the second. Catcher Jason Robertson will lead things off against Sosinski. He grounds it to the right side. Helton has it. Helton over to Dessa, and Dessa drops the ball. Another error for UC Santa Barbara, and Fielding has hurt the Gauchos in the last few games. Dessa makes the play now. On to second to Regan. Relay on to first is not in time, so they do get the lead runner. And Daniel Buchanan steps in. He has some pop in his bat. You've got to watch out for him. And he goes around on that one. 0-1 delivery from Sosinski. And Buchanan drives it deep to right field. And Sorgi's just watching that one uh, sail onto the street out there. A home run for Daniel Buchanan. A two-run shot. And Oklahoma is up 3 to nothing. And Brett Mallett will step in. We're in the top of the second. Change up and the batter goes around. 0 2 count, the delivery high fastball taken for ball one. And the breaking ball gets Mallet to swing and miss. And the lineup will turn over for the Sooners. Bubba Lunsford steps in. Had a triple back in the first inning. 0 1 count, he fouls this one up the third base line. 0 2 delivery to Lunsford. And this one is off Savsinski. Lunsford's got Wills, and Savsinski's not going to catch him. Here is Carson. Makes the catch out in foul territory. And that ends the second inning for the Sooners. We go to the bottom of the second. John Regan will lead things off for the Gauchos. Here's the delivery from Tolar. And Regan lines this one up the middle. Base hit. And the Gauchos will get the leadoff guy on for Adam Geyer. Geyer takes the fork ball off the plate. And the two-seamer runs away, 2-0 count. Four-seamer over the plate for strike one. Two-seamer high, we got a 3-1 count. Fastball catches the outside corner. And the circle change breaks away. And the Gauchos have their first two batters on here in the bottom of the second. This pitch in the dirt. 1-1 count now. Four-seamer swung on. 1-2, and then the circle change, swung on and missed. And Dessa strikes out. Tyler Drever now with one out, runners on first and second. Going to ground it to the right side, and Buchanan steps on the bag for out number two. Gene Sorgi now with runners on second and third. Chance to cut into the Oklahoma lead. 0-2 count, Sorgi swings and misses. Takes the fastball down and away. Checks his swing, 2-2 delivery. And Sorgi lifts it to right field. Falk is out there, and he will make the catch. At the end of the second, three runs on four hits for Oklahoma. No runs on one hit and one error for the Gauchos. Ground ball to third base. Carson has it. He's going to have to hurry. It's not in time. As Carson tried to backhand it, but misplayed the handle. Runner on first for the Sooners. And a line drive to third. Carson has it. And the runner scampers back to first. There is one down now in the top of the third. A runner on, and this is Pettyjohn. Pettyjohn swings at the cutter and misses. 2-1 count now. The delivery from Sosinski, slider. Swung on and missed, and the four-seamer down and away. 
gets the strikeout. Petty John will sit down. That's the second out of the inning. And Jason Robertson will step in, batting 258. He's 0 for 1 on the day. Runner on first. He swings and misses at the slider. 0-1 count. Here's the delivery. Chopper to the right side. Dessa has it. And Dessa will tag him for the out. In the middle of three, it's Oklahoma three, Santa Barbara nothing, and Jim Zerbe will lead off the bottom of the third inning for the Gauchos. Tolar gets strike one on the circle change. And then a ground ball to the right side. This is Guzman on to Buchanan for the out. And the lineup will turn over for the Gauchos. Jeremy Helton grounds it to third. Kessel on to Buchanan for the out. And we've got two down in the inning. Rafael Carson with two outs, bottom of the third. Carson looks at a fork ball off the plate. 2-0 count now. Here's the delivery from Tolar. 2-1 and one as that one catches the inside corner. And this four-seamer is off the plate away. 3-2 count. Here's the payoff pitch. Ground ball to the right side. It gets through for a base hit. And the Gauchos have a runner on. Nate Coltrinari batting 209 with Carson on first. 0-1 count and two outs. Coltrinari lifts this one deep to left field. Going back is a Bolt, and Bolt makes the catch right at the wall. Geyer gave that one a ride, and here is left fielder Matt Bolt, who just made the play to end the third inning. He is leading off the fourth. 2-0 delivery. Sofsinski, 3-0 now. And this one is chopped down the right field line. Called foul. It looked fair to me. And the 3-2 count. Lifted into left. Geyer coming in. Makes the catch. Daniel Buchanan steps in. Batting 328. One for one on the day with a home run. And two RBIs for the Sooners who lead it 3-0 here in the fourth. 0-2 count. Ground ball to the right side. Dessa has it. And he will step on the bag for the out. Brett Mallett will step in now with two outs. Mallett swings and misses at the slider. And line drive to Regan, a soft line drive. Regan takes care of it. In the middle of four, it's still three to nothing, and Regan will lead things off, batting 333 on the air. He's one for one today. Here's the delivery from Al Tolar, taken for strike one. Second pitch is fouled back. And the circle change swung on and missed. So good morning, good afternoon, good night. With one out, 0-1 delivery, ball one. This one catches the inside corner and swung on and missed. That'll bring up Warren Dessa, the first baseman, with two outs. Nobody on here in the bottom of the fourth inning. Tolar misses with his first offering. Swung on and missed, a 1-1 count. Another pitch outside. Two-seamer might have been low. That one was chased. And the 2-2 delivery is lifted into right field. And that one's going to drop harmlessly in foul territory. And the 2-2 delivery fouled off. Another foul ball. Nice at bat here. 2-2 two -two count. And the fork ball swung on and missed for out number three. We go to the fifth inning. Sooners lead 3 to nothing. Bubba Lunsford, the leadoff guy. Will lead off the inning. He grounds it to the left side. Oh, actually, it was uh, in the air to the left side, and Carson makes the catch. And Rolando Guzman will step in with one down. Guzman takes the four-seamer. Grounds it right back to Sosinski. And Sosinski is on to Dessau at first. We've got two outs for Corey Kessel. One for two with a double and an RBI today, and he is going to slice this one into right center field. It's going to get all the way to the wall. Zerby after it. He'll run it down. But that is going to be another triple for the Sooners. And it'll bring up Jim Falk. Kessel on third base now. And the Gauchos will put Falk with his five home runs on first base intentionally. And pitch to Pettyjohn. And Pettyjohn lines it to Dessau for the final out of the inning. And that'll bring up Tyler Drever, the catcher. UC Santa Barbara's offense has been anemic here. For much of the season, I've had a few outbursts of runs, but a lot of low averages and uh, tough 
tough going so far offensively for the Gauchos. Here's Gene Sorgi. Doesn't hurt that we have, or it doesn't help that we have uh, Farinacci, probably our best hitter, who is out for most of the season with an injury, so that does not help us. Jim Zerby now, the center fielder, steps in. Two outs, the delivery from Tolar. Swung on and missed, 0-1 count. And we are at 0-2, fork ball off the plate, 1-2 count. And check swing. He did not go around, the third base umpire says. And then this one has popped into left field. And Bolt is there to squeeze it. End of the fifth, it's 3-0 Oklahoma. We go to the top of the sixth, Jason Robertson. Sooners trying to win the rubber match of this series. They these two teams split the first two games. Helton on to first for out number one, and that'll bring up Matt Bolt. Bolt, the left fielder. Change up over the outside corner, 0-1. Here is the ground ball to the right side. Dessa has it, and he's going to toss it to Savsinski, covering for out number two. Daniel Buchanan, and Buchanan lifts this one high into center field. Zerby is there. He'll squeeze it. In the middle of six, three runs, five hits for Oklahoma. No runs, two hits, and two errors for the Gauchos. Here's the delivery. Fastball down to Helton. Helton, maybe this is Regan. I can't remember. I think this is Regan, guys. One, two, count to Regan. Swung on and missed. Nope, I was wrong. It was Helton. They have similar batting stances. That was Helton, not Regan. Don't listen to me. And this is Daniel Carson, the third baseman, with one out, 0-2 delivery in the bottom of the sixth inning. And Tolar gets Carson to strike out swinging. That'll bring up the designated hitter, Nate Coltranari. Coltranari lines this one to third. Catch is made by Kessel. And we will go to the seventh inning with the Oklahoma Sooners leading 3 to nothing. Do the Gauchos have a big inning in them to try to get back into this game? Ground ball to the right side is foul. And the ground ball to the left side. Carson on to first for the out. And Bubba Lunsford, who is two for three with a triple on the day, steps in. He grounds this one softly to the right side. Dessa will step on the back for out number two. And the second baseman, Rolando Guzman, batting 233 on the year. And Guzman with a slow roller to Carson. And Carson on to first for the out. We stretch here in Santa Barbara. Score still, Oklahoma 3, Santa Barbara nothing. And John Regan now, you can see his stance is a lot like Helton's. And Regan pops this one up into left field. And the shortstop going back, Mallet makes the catch for the first out. And Adam Geyer to the plate. Geyer swings and misses at the first pitch. 0-1 delivery. Al Tolar working into the seventh inning for Oklahoma. 1-2 count, and this one is going to be lined back up the middle for a base hit. And Geyer is on for Warren Dessa, who's 0 for 2 with a pair of strikeouts on the day. And Dessa looks at strike 2, and then lines the third pitch into center field for a base hit. And that'll move a runner into scoring position for Tyler Drever in the bottom of the seventh. Santa Barbara. Only down three runs. Drever represents the tying run at the plate. And he is going to ground this one through the hole on the right side. Bases are going to be loaded as the runner will hold up at third. And Corey Haynes, the right fielder, will step in with one down. Haynes takes the fastball low. 1-0 count. Here is the pitch. And this one is skied into left field. And they're going to call an infield fly rule. That one was a little bit out of the infield, but the umpire makes the call. With two outs. A 1-2 count. And this one is swung on and lined to short. Mallet makes the play. And the Gaucho strand the bases loaded. As we go to the eighth inning, Meester is going to come in. He's got a 3.77 ERA so far this year out of the pen. And we start off the top of the eighth inning. Swung on and missed, a 1-1 count. Meester's delivery, slider. Catches the outside corner, 1-2. This one is in on the fist, but a nice base hit going the other way. Jim Falk now will step in. That was a nice piece of hitting by Kessel. And Kessel is on first with nobody out. 
And Falk grounds this one up the middle for a base hit. Kessel moves on to second. And Antoine Pettijohn, batting 237, will have a runner in scoring position with nobody out. He's going to ground it to Helton on the right side. And that will serve to move the runners up. A nice uh, piece of hitting there by Pettijohn. And this one is lined back up the middle by Robertson. One run will score. A second one comes around and will score as well. And it is five to nothing, Oklahoma, with one out in the eighth. Bolt, ground ball to Carson. Carson on to first for the out. He had no play at second. And Daniel Buchanan steps in with the base open. And they choose to pitch to him. He grounds it up the middle. Runner around third, heading to the plate. The throw from Zerby is going to be well late. And it is six to nothing. Sooners with the lead. Brett Mallett steps in now. Still facing Meester, as Meester had one job to try to keep the score at three to nothing, and he's failed at that. Ground ball to Regan. Regan on to first to Dessa. And we go to the bottom of the eighth with Oklahoma leading six to nothing. Helton, Carson, and Coltrinari do up for the Gauchos. In the bottom of the eighth, Tolar is still throwing off the hill for the Sooners. 0-1 delivery. Ground ball to the right side. Played by Guzman on to Buchanan for the out. And we've got one down in the bottom of the eighth. And here is a base hit to the right side. And Coltrinari will step up with a runner on first and one out. And Coltrinari with a line drive into right. Catch is made by Falk. And the runner will have to retreat. We've got two outs for John Regan now. He's batting 324, our best, best hitter by average and by power. So far on the year, 1-1 one, one count, and he's going to ground this one up the third baseline and into left field for a base hit. Runner coming around second. We'll hold up at third, and we've got runners on the corners for Adam Geyer with two outs. Geyer lines it up the middle, and Santa Barbara's going to get on the board. This one's rolling into left center field. Lunsford takes a bad angle at it. It gets past him. Runner from first is coming around third, and he will score. And... The batter is thrown out trying to stretch that into a triple, but he uh, was not thrown out until the run crossed the plate, so it's 6-2 to two as we head to the ninth. Lunsford with the ground ball to Carson, on to first for the out, one down, and the ground ball up the middle, Regan can't reach it. Zerby's going to play it in center field, and we got a base runner on for Oklahoma. Here is Kessel. Kessel with a runner on first, grounds it through the hole on the right side, Haynes. Out there and left, gets it in. He pinch hit for Sorgi a couple innings ago. 1-0 count, 2-0 now. 2-1 with one out, circle change. 2-2 count. And this one is lifted into left just over the shortstop's head. And the bases are loaded for the Sooners. And they are going to pull Meester out of the game and bring in Ivan Zayas. And Zayas will come on with the bases loaded and one out. Curveball catches the back door. 0-2 oh, with one out. Curveball swung on and missed. 1-2. and two. And the cutter gets him looking. So there's two outs for Robertson. And Robertson grounds this one up the third baseline. 0-1. Oh, Curveball swung on and missed. Here is the pitch from Zayas. Ground ball to Regan. Regan on to first. And he makes the play. It is six to two, Oklahoma with the lead, and Crow is gonna come in to try to nail this one down for the Sooners. Bottom of the ninth inning, 0-2 count. Last hacks for the Gauchos in this game. And the slider catches the plate, you be the judge. The umpire rings him up on that one. That looked a little bit off the plate, if not high to me, but we have to live with it. 0-1 count with one out. Swung on and missed. 0-2 count now. And the sinker swung on and missed again. And another strikeout for Crow will bring up right fielder Corey Haynes. Corey Haynes batting 143 on the year. He lifts the first pitch into shallow left. And that one is taken care of by Mallet. The Sooners get the win here in Santa Barbara. They win the rubber match by a score of 6-2. Kessel went four for five with a double, one triple, and an RBI. Buchanan two for four with a home run and three RBIs. 
Tolar gets the win for the Sooners. He went eight innings, gave up eight hits, two runs, six strikeouts, and a walk. Savsinski gets tagged with the loss. He falls to one and four. Geyer was two for three with two RBIs, and Carson two for four, and he scored a run. At the end of this episode, Cal State Fullerton at 13 and eight leads the Big West Conference. Irvine in second, Long Beach State in third, and we are fourth at nine and ten, three games behind the uh, conference leading Cal State Fullerton Titans. Cal Poly brings up the rear at five and fourteen. All right, that is UC Santa Barbara Gauchos baseball episode number eight. Up next, we will start conference play against UC Riverside, and we will uh, simulate the three games against Louisiana Lafayette to get conference play started. I'm excited to get conference play started and start playing some teams uh, that are on our level and that we can possibly have a good shot at beating. So that is UC Santa Barbara Gauchos Baseball on MVP 06 NCAA Baseball on Mama's Basement Sports Gaming.